one, this is their dad. I'm here and it's very hot. I don't know why. Okay, goodbye. Good morning. It is very bright. But right now we are heading off to Pika's Cafe unless we get sidetracked again and let me find another place. And give up. And give up. Just give up. So yeah. Day two. And we're eating gummy bears at uh, 8 a.m. in the morning. So yes, right now. we'll update you with what we actually eat. We ended up in Port of Mocha. Port of Mocha. It is uh, a small cafe that is right beside the place we live in. We saw it and we're like, you know what? We're hungry. We're, we can't look for Pika Cafe right now. We're just done with life. And so that's where we are. I got a, me and my sister got a wild berry smoothie. And I got this salmon wrap. It's red. So and I then, guess that means it's healthy. And, and that then got that coffee. got coffee. Good day again. We are done eating breakfast in the small cafe and right now we are waiting for the bus. We're waiting for the bus that's arriving at 9.45. Going to Micronesia Mall and from Micronesia Mall we're gonna go to Two Lovers Point, our first stop of the day. Yeah, so that's it. Currently on the highway where we were walking in yesterday. So there, basically this whole thing, that strip is where we were walking yesterday trying to get to Micronesia Mall because we didn't know there was a bus to get there. Never guess what happened. So we're on the shuttle now. Okay? Going to Two Lovers Point and we enter and it's the Kuya or the guy from the bus yesterday who we asked, does this go to Two Lovers Point when you're walking along the highway? And then he was just like, yes. And then we continued to walk on the highway. And then when I entered the bus, he kind of started to be like, okay. And then it was the same guy. And, and then he asked that, so how was your, how was your walk? How is our walk painful? It's good. It's good. 10 out of 10. Thanks, Kuya, for remembering mm. us. We've made it to the Two Lovers Point. I will... Two Lovers Point. Um, Puntan Dos Amantes. It's Spanish, I think. Or Mexican. Okay, so we're gonna go around and I'll show you the place. Oh my gosh, it's so hot. My sister has an umbrella. Okay, so yeah, it's bright enough. It's bright enough. Look at these hearts. Okay. Now look at this water. Wow, so nice. I'm breaking down, yo. So we won't be able to take a picture, so here it is. Us and the two lovers. Everyone say hi. Hi. Okay, never mind. She's Back in the trolley, ran to the trolley, trolley, trolley. <laughs> and then I went it's to the same the bus, And he was like, it's the same driver, there's only one. So he knows everything. He knows everyone. Bye. Bro, well, I miss a lot of this family being lost. So, Dad was like, okay guys, let's go down the trolley. But then we have to go to Micronesia Mall to get to another beach. Basically, we should have never went down the bus. But we did! <laughs> so now we have to wait for another one. <laughs> we are back again. All our vlogs are in the trolley. Yeah, and Dad didn't want to sit with us. No, no, sit with us. He's over there. Made it to Micronesia Mall and we're getting Panda Express. Dad wanted a snack, so... We got our Panda Express. Orange chicken, of course. Dad got freaking apertada. As if we don't have apertada in Manila. Okay, let's, let's get our fortune cookie. It says, you will have good luck in your personal affairs. I need that. <laughs> so we finished eating. We're literally always in my like in this area of my condition. Mm -hmm. So we finished eating and right now we're trying to book our first Troll Guam ride. Uh, okay, so, so the driver is approaching and we'll see if 
we actually end up in the car. It's eleven dollars from Micronesia Mall to Tungguisan Beach, and apparently, Tungguisan Beach is nobody goes there. So, yo to the low. So yes, we'll see you if we see you in the car. We made it. We're in our store now, and yeah, I'm excited. So. Hello, we are in Tangisan Beach. Super, super deserted. I will show you clips later. We're literally like the only people here and like four other people. Aside from a few locals and stuff. Yes, it's like a local place. So our driver, our stroll driver will be picking us up in an hour and a half from now. So yeah, there's like a power plant here. It's just very beaten down, like nobody's here. And right now, right now this is our setup. Tambayan place. Ah! <laughs> So yes, a couple of rocks and some trees. And then this is the beach. Wow, you can barely see it, but there it is. So yeah, that's it. Hi, so we're done swimming. Sorry we didn't film any of it. It was very rocky and it Quick was hard dip. to bring the camera. Because like we'd probably fall. Yeah, but basically, like we walked over there. Okay. And then, yeah, we went to that rock formation thingy. Uh, and there's my sister, Gross. So yeah, we're going to dry up at the grass with the sand and then we're going to see Noreen again and yeah, bring us to Gun Beach. Hi, so this is going to be our review for Tangisan Beach for anybody who's watching and wants to go to Guam. One word. Don't. Ugly. Savage. He's a hater. So basically, there's it's a lot of trash. Very rocky, like as in my feet. No! And it's like, it's really hard to get here, so if you use a tax, just don't. Hello. We made it to Gun Beach, so Noreen came and picked us up. And we drove, yeah, she drove us all the way here to Gun Beach, so it's much, much nicer than Tangguisan Beach. And this is our new Tambayan. We got some stuff hanging, that's over there, as usual. And it's very, very hot, like, it's like three. It shouldn't be as hot anymore, but it still is. So we're playing some. So hot. yeah, um, we'll see you later. Yeah. Right now we are going to begin our photo shoot. There she is, and we have to walk up all the way up there just to get the shot. So we'll film some clips for you. So yes. We took a lot of photos over there. I'm sure Ati inserted some artsy videos. So we're gonna head back, take some more photos by the sand, and then head out to Dad's favorite freaking GPO, Guam Premier Outlet. And there Ati is. We are done swimming for the day. Yeah, so we packed up. Now we're on the way to the trolley, our favorite, to get a ride to GPO where we're gonna change and do some shopping. So yes, that looks like a member from Survivor as always. Okay, we are we, we are in Guam Premier Outlet. And Your hair is so messy. I know. But our freaking favorite. We got this, we got this. Cross. Yeah. See you inside. We'll show you inside. We got cinnamon. Hey. <laughs> Ariana got a churro. Hello, so we are here in Ross. We are about to go shopping, so we got a cart. Dad gave us $100 each and an hour. So let's see what we can get. It's so dark. Okay, so probably don't see us. But Dad's showing us what he got from the Guam Premier Outlets. And it's nice And we are leaving. Okay. Hello. Hi, so we are in Little Pika's. We ordered our food. Yep, we're waiting for it. I got salmon and Nina and her share. And Dad, Dad got both doggy Um, So our food arrived. Oof, oof. Hey, huh? I love my family. That's them, because they don't want to cross the street with me. So I'm alone. I can't believe they would do this to me. Hello, good evening. So we are back in the apartment and we passed by ABC store just to get a few supplies for tomorrow. 
like food and water. And then basically, I'm gonna show you guys a little short haul about the stuff I bought in Ross. Sorry for that. Uh, my dad just bought two watches, and my sister didn't get to buy anything. And I, okay. So, first thing I got, I wanna show you guys is this, like, is this tank top. Just a white tank top. It's super simple. There's a V cut, and for $5. Next is a. Mm, it's a five dollar um rose, I don't know, just a baby pink whatever t tan tube top for five dollars. Yeah, five dollars as well. And oh my god, sorry for that sock. Then this super cute, it's gingham. Yeah, gingham <coughs> linen type of tube top where you can tie at the back for seven dollars. Yeah, seven dollars, six ninety nine. And then okay. This shirt is super. I freaking dig this shirt so much. It's like a lazy girl shirt. It's got flowers on it. And then I got it for $8. So, yes. Pretty cute. And then, okay, my. Literally, such an impulse purchase. Like, I was about to. I was done already, and then I saw this. I was like, oh my god, I have to get it. So, yes, yeah, so it's just the Tommy Hilfiger collared shirt. Yeah, it's an extra small, and I got it for 17 Not bad. So yeah, it was discounted for like $5, so $5 little makes a difference. That's it, and yeah, so that's it. Good night, and we'll see you tomorrow. Or 